My name is Faith Atieno. I'm from Kibera, the founder of Art360, and I paint visual art. What pushed me to open a gallery was the feeling of trying to bring my own vibe and people who love what I'm doing to create a culture. I love doing abstract painting because I don't want to sell a standard type of painting. I want to do what I feel like and send a message and someone to come and communicate with it. Most of, of my pieces are inspired by women. So this is a, a normal bag, but now to me, it's a piece and it's a piece about Corona. My focus was on these women who are still struggling to survive despite Corona and the commotion that we have around in our community. This looks like a bug, but it's not a bug to me. These are the challenges we face every day. We have more than five artist youths who come here every day to do what they love. When we are doing this concept, we don't individualize it. We make it open, we discuss it, then we make a sketch. We don't want it to be an individual idea. We want to bring a strong image from different artists and to communicate with the different people. So today we are going to create awareness to the kids, the youths and the mothers of Kibera to see the other side of coronavirus. It's not always easy to survive on paint and brush. Coronavirus have put more pressure into this feeling because we don't showcase what we are doing because there are no exhibitions. As we know, most of the population in Kibera depend on doing their own businesses to attract their income. So we depend so much on people coming to Kibera, people around can't afford buying painting. And now there are few people to sell what you are doing to, and that reduces the income to the community generally. And that's why it's important to fight COVID-19 to return things normal because things are not the same with us as an artist. The messages we are trying to send are creating awareness on the Mabati, the rugged walls around Kibera of the cautions they need to take to avoid being affected by COVID-19. There is a lot of activities going on, so people will definitely pass by and we make it visible and strong in message for them to see. The government, I don't take their approach as the best, pushing us to say, stay at home. I've seen them throwing tear gas. We have seen brutality, people being beaten up to stay at home. There are different avenues, I feel, as a person that should be taken, like bringing a station to help us identify those who are sick, to be taken to a proper place and to those who are not affected to stay in the community. That will help us avoid contraction. And we as a community, we should also take precautions and take good direction to fight COVID-19. Attracting people and inspiring others and uh, getting new skills, to me, that is greater than anything.